For a number of years, people thought the best way to reduce aggression was to teach problem-solving skills. He knocked this down, but that's okay. Let's build it back up. This worked, but only moderately well. What Larry Aber of New York University and his colleagues found was that children who react aggressively tend to interpret other people's behaviors toward them as hostile without enough evidence to be certain. Children who are constantly in conflict with other children and teachers are on a path where they're not learning now and they're going to learn less in the future. How can you tell that this guy wants is not having fun? So what we've done is move back in that sequence and help children not immediately make the presumption that it is hostile intent. Dr. Aber and his colleagues evaluated a curriculum in the New York City public schools that helps children learn the skill of perspective taking, understanding what's behind another person's behavior before reacting. What does it mean to have a conflict? This curriculum called the four R's, reading, writing, respect, and resolution, doesn't separate teaching children how to handle conflict from other academic teaching. Each unit is based on a book. Mean Jean was recess queen, and nobody said any different. If kids ever crossed her, she'd push them and smush them and lava caloose them. Teachers use high-quality children's literature on social topics to do a series of things that help children learn how to read the intentions of others more accurately. Through discussions, writing exercises, and role play, children learn to appraise complex situations and are taught how to resolve them. What kind of face do you see here? Is it because she's upset about her friend? We are finding that the children who are receiving a combined balanced literacy and social emotional learning curriculum do not increase over the elementary school years in their tendency to interpret uh, ambiguous uh, cues as hostile and intent and they get in less fights. What are some of the things that can cause a conflict between two people? An argument. An argument. Children who can understand others' intents have less of a need to strike or hurt others. What's the best attitude that we should have? Standing up for yourself. Yeah, being strong. Adults can help children learn these appraisal skills. When reading, we can ask children to think about the character's feelings and thoughts. Dylan goes up to Tilly and he goes, Wah. How do you think she feels when he does that? Makes faces at her. So sad. Or encourage them to think about other people's responses to everyday situations. And so then Tilly goes after Dylan and tries to kick him. It's not nice. That is an issue of learning. It's not just uh, a side affair. 